<clears throat> hey everybody, it's Tucker here, and I just wanted to do a video today on my chickens. It's going to be an update on them. And, um, and here's the baby chicks we hatched. There are seven of them in here, and uh, this is my new brooder. I uh, just took a, a old wire rabbit cage and I uh, put some legs on it and it's in here now and I leave this door closed for that way they can stay warmer and then here's the door right there <clears throat> but as you can see they just kind of stay under the heat lamp so they don't have to go far for their water or their feed and uh, they like it in here they've been running around and the majority of these are barred rocks so uh, I kind of you know like I like I like them a really good bit you know because uh, I'm not, I don't know if I'm going to keep any with them, those, since I already have one hen in, out, another, added another hen, because the other one, but, uh, I'll probably end up selling some of these, because the majority of them is barred rock, I think there's, since they're eight hatch, I'm pretty sure five of them are barred rocks, and then uh, three of, them, of the other ones are just mixed, mixed, half barred rock and half something else, I know that white one's one of them, and there's one of them with feathers on their feet, and the one upstairs is a barred rock too. There's another one there that's mixed in somewhere along the way. And uh, over here, um, I got this um, coop I've been building on. I just built a door for it. And uh, I know it's a little short looking, but I'll just take a, a latch and uh, hook it. And um, I'm, this is just something I've got out of pallets. It's kind of sturdy, but I'm not finished with it, so I need to like, nail some more things down and all that. That way it's a little bit more sturdy, but it's kind of roomy in here. No, not a lot of rain gets in here. And I, that's why I'm still working on it. I'm probably going to nail these down since these move a lot. Well, And then... uh. Um, that's some, about all in here. I'm gonna put some sticks and some roost, and uh, it's gonna be kind of for my some just chickens. I have extra if I get some more, and I just like kind of like I keep my barred rock separate. This could be a pen where I keep them separate, but I don't know. It could be some I just put chickens in temporarily. That's what I was kind of thinking of, just to put you know chickens in kind of a. Use it kind of as a grow out pen, kind of also, and probably for her a little bit too. Probably where she'll end up going is in is in there because she, right now she's living in there, and that kind of makes the yard look a little junky. So I'm probably gonna take that down and move her in there, possibly. Not real sure yet, but in here I got rid of my three bannies and uh, gave them to my grandpa. I didn't need them. Now we only have 13 chickens, so that's good. And um, she likes to come up here during the day and uh, scratch around. And as you can see, she scratches it all out and just finds things in there. And then I'm going to clean them out and probably have some baby chicks in them too. We don't know yet. Well, I don't know yet anyway. And um, in here... I, yesterday I cleaned these pens out and they all got to run around while I was doing it all day and as you can see yeah, probably ain't no eggs today I just I put some plastic eggs in there to kind of mess around and not really kind of do an experiment and see how maybe because see they like this nest better so I'm gonna see if they'll lay in this nest ninny uh, I got some fresh hay down and um, in here as well, I'm going to hang this feeder. I need to, anyway. And I'm putting up another roost in here. I'm putting up another roost in here and over in that pen, too. Looks like they are lazy, but it might need to tape those eggs shut. But I don't know. I might end up taking them out before long. Oh, and in here, I put my two other chicks that I raised in here about three weeks, three, three, four weeks ago, I put them in there. And, uh, they they stopped picking on them. I'm probably gonna get rid of her. You know, I mean she's beautiful and all, but I'm just I'm probably just gonna get rid of her to cut down on some more chickens. Um, and um, what was that? Oh yeah, I also yeah uh, yesterday I went to Tractor Supply and I bought a new water like the same exact one up there, but uh, there was something missing on it, so I had to take it back. But uh, that's a one of my new 
pull it because she came she's she came out of that hen that went broody and raised them so I'm gonna keep her in here that way I'll have four hens and a rooster in there but I'm probably gonna get rid of the other ones right now it's five but get rid of her Waddle sleeps in here at night and she just poops everywhere and makes a mess everywhere so that's why I've been letting her out lately every day but so I'm probably gonna put her in there that way I ain't gotta let her out anymore and uh I guess that about wraps up what everything's going on around here. And it's, all the chickens are doing good. And I mean, they all got to run around yesterday and have some some fun. And I'm, I don't know about them Red Rangers. I might end up getting rid of those because they aren't the best layers. And uh, they're more of a meat bird, so we might end up eating them. But uh, thanks for watching, guys. And uh, I hope you enjoyed this video today. And uh, like, comment, and subscribe, and thanks for watching. Bye.